we're gonna this, she's gonna be changed even though she's the sitting vice president and then on top of that this idea of change when the democrats have been in control for what 12 or 16 years right which is crazy like this is the change yeah i mean obviously i, I view this election as a turning point um like a fork in the road of destiny that is uh, incredibly important um you know i've not i've not been politically active until this election and the reason i've been politically active this election is because i think if we don't if we don't elect trump i think we i think we will lose uh we will act, we will lose democracy in this country. We will we will lose the two party system, um, and I, I, let me explain why. So, there's there's only like six six or seven swing states. The the, the margin of victory in those states is small, often like ten or twenty thousand votes. Um, what the the Democrat administration has been doing is importing vast numbers of illegals into swing states. Um, you can look at the numbers on the actual government uh, website. Meaning you don't take my word for it. You'll just look look at the numbers as reported by the government. Which is controlled by the Democrats, like, like, like are, because you can you can break it down. So, like, are are any of these numbers wrong? Because we got these numbers from homeland homeland security government dot gov. Okay, right. <laughs> so we got it from the dot gov web, website. Has the government reported these numbers incorrectly? No, they have not. Those numbers, if anything, are are low. Um, so okay, so they have in fact uh, flown vast numbers of illegals to swing states. Yeah, um, bypassing the border entirely. And uh, so that, that is factually true. Then you can say, like, well, what is their probable voting pattern? Um, oh, okay, overwhelmingly Democrat into swing states. Um, and, and what we're seeing is triple-digit increases in the number of illegals in every swing state. In some cases, 700% increases. These are, these are gigantic numbers. Um, so if you, if, if you have a state that, was, that, that, went, that, that has a 10 or 20,000 vote margin and you put 200,000 illegals into that state. You 10x the, the you, you swamp the, it's, it's not a swing state anymore. It's going to vote blue. And then, and then once the swing states vote blue, the, the, there, there is no election anymore. It's, there's only a Democrat primary. Which is so crazy. And so, it's so crazy that people are fine with that. Well, I guess people on the left will be fine with that because they think that's a good idea. Well, they, they just want to win. They just want to win. Correct. It, it, like the thing is, like, like you, you, one does not need actually any grand conspiracy theory for this. You just have to look at the simple matter of incentives. If if the if the Democrat Party wants to win, like basically achieve permanent victory, all they need to do is is turn the swing states, turn the swing states blue, they have permanent victory. And then we're one. Then we're a, a one party state, and then they they will keep doing that. Obviously, they'll keep, they will keep stacking the deck. Uh, by bringing in vast numbers of illegals into the swing states, keep stacking it so that the next election, each successive election, will be worse than the last one. And that's what's happening. If, if, and if you want to see, like, well, is this actually going to happen? Look at California. California is supermajority Dem, 70% Dem. Uh, a month ago, they passed a law making it illegal to show ID in any election in California. So, you, so, so a friend of mine went to vote uh, in, in, um, in Palo Alto, because he was like, "Is this for real?" He tried to show his ID, and they, they, they reacted like a like 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 if you show a cross to a vampire. Okay, <laughs> they're like, "No, we can't even look at that ID." It's, it is illegal for them to even look at your ID if you want to present it in California. Why for any election at all, even like city council? What logical reason other than to cheat would you ever have that law? The reason is to cheat. That's but the only Obviously. it's only like you can never make an argument. Any other way, and I think eighty-four yeah. percent of people polled believe that you should show ID to vote. So it's against the will of the people. Yes, and, and th 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 we are extremely rare. We're an outlier in not requiring ID. Basically, almost every country on earth requires ID to vote. So, so the the, the well, as soon as you make you ban ID for voting, it makes fraud impossible to prove. Because how do you trace the fraud? Right. Yeah, it's insane. It's insane. It's insane. And, and what I'm saying is that... How is it legal? That, is that, is that, what I'm saying is, like, this election is the last chance to preserve democracy in America. Mark my words. Uh, everything they accuse Trump of, they are guilty of. Um, and and if, if Trump doesn't win, this will be the last real election in America. Um, and we will... If, 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 the, if the Kamala... If the big government Kamala puppet machine wins, uh, they will legalize the illegals in the swing states. There will be no swing states. 
every election going forward will be a, 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 a guaranteed Democrat win. And it'll actually be worse than California. The reason it'll be worse than California is because the one thing that keeps California from being super crazy is that you can move out of California like you and I did. We, you and I used to be in California, but we moved to Texas. We're still in America. But if, if the Dems win this election, they will legalize enough illegals to turn the swing states and everywhere will be like California. There will be no escape. That is so insane. This is the final, this is it. This is the last chance. Has anybody tried and to I push back? And I just want to like, go out and vote. Vote like your life depends on it. Vote like your future depends on it. Because it does. This is the last chance, man.